Welcome to a disturbing discovery that has been kept secret for more than two decades. There is a story of gloom and misery amid the sparkling world of Dubai's royal family. Today, we reveal the heartbreaking story of Princess Shamsa, a sad mystery that has gripped the globe. Stay tuned as we unravel the mysteries that have plagued this princess for 22 years. This is your source for thought-provoking stuff, so subscribe and press that notification bell if you haven't already. Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum reigned as a strong and enigmatic figure in the wealthy Kingdom of Dubai, where luxury knows no boundaries. As the King of Dubai and a millionaire, he had considerable power. But there was a dark aspect to the veneer of grandeur. Many have labeled him pure evil. He had at least 30 children from several marriages, including Princess Shamza and her sister, Princess Latifa. Princess Shamsa, who was born in 1981, has a free personality. She admired Western culture and ideals, having been raised in part in the United Kingdom. She wished for a society in which women had greater freedom and rights. Shamsa was not your ordinary princess. She desired adventure and aspired to break Arab customs. Her father, Sheikh Mohammed, saw her as a wayward and rebellious daughter. When she indicated a desire to further her studies at the University of Cambridge, her father shattered her hopes with a thundering no. Shamsa devised an escape strategy in order to avoid living a life of regret. She carried out her escape plot in the summer of 2000 while living at her father's palace in England. She was whisked away to Cambridge via a covert meeting. However, escaping the King of Dubai proved virtually impossible. Her ambitions were destroyed when a squad of operatives found her down and forcibly returned her to Dubai. Her confinement marked the start of a horrific struggle. Shamsa's cherished sister, Latifa, was unable to assist. The Cambridge Police Department initiated an inquiry into the kidnapping, but it was hampered by a lack of evidence. Sheikh Mohammed's clout and ties in the United Kingdom. Shamsa was imprisoned for eight painful years. She awoke as a ghost of herself, highly drugged to inhibit her volition. Her bright energy had died, and she had been reduced to a mere shell of her former self. An inquiry into the kidnapping was revived in 2018, and in 2019, a high court judge determined that Sheikh Mohammed had stolen both girls and held them against their will. Latifa said that her father's fixation with appearance and reputation pushed him to commit atrocities. However, the narrative does not finish here. The mysteries of the Dubai royal family go far deeper than we can comprehend. Princess Haya, one of Sheikh Mohammed's wives, deserted him, probably after learning more unpleasant details about the family's inner workings. This family's web of mystery and intrigue seemed to have no end. Princess Shamsa, 41, is still imprisoned in Dubai, her release a distant dream. The world is watching, and the question lingers. Will Shamsa ever return to the life she once knew? The road to justice and liberty is far from done, and it is up to us to keep the tale alive. As we dive more into Princess Shamsa's heartbreaking narrative, it becomes clear that her struggle is not an isolated occurrence, but rather a reflection of the hidden complexity inside Dubai's royal family. The story of Princess Shamsa and her sister, Latifa, is a terrifying warning that evil may flourish, even in the most luxurious and powerful circles. The discovery of these dark truths has not only enthralled the globe, but it has also highlighted critical concerns about justice, freedom, and power abuse. The tale of Princess Shamsa, now 41 and still imprisoned in Dubai, exemplifies the human spirit's tenacity in the face of adversity. It emphasizes the need of bringing injustice to light, regardless of how strong the culprits are. While we work to keep Princess Shamsa's tale alive and seek justice for her, let us not forget that there may be many others suffering in silence. Our call to action goes beyond this single tragedy. It's a call to speak up for the voiceless, to demand transparency, and to confront power abuse wherever it may lurk. By subscribing to our channel, expressing your ideas, and remaining involved in these critical debates, you are helping to shape a brighter future in which justice triumphs over injustice and the truth rises from the shadows. Join us in the battle for justice and stay tuned for more important news. Let us maintain the emphasis on Princess Shamsa's search for freedom and the truth that must prevail till next time. We can make a difference together, not only for Shamsa, but for all those who deserve to be heard. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and recommend to someone who may also love our stories. See you in the next one.